me this morning. She called me this morning and she explained that she, as she was getting ready, she said, um, the Lord just really strongly impressed on her heart uh, that she really needs to be getting more water okay for this ark I think I shared another video she and her husband were called to prepare an ark for their adult children who they believe are going to be here for the tribulation so she's been storing up water and and food and making preparation for them okay and so and she really I mean she was in tears pretty much begging me to do this video and share with you uh, what she believes is the heart of the Father for those who are going to be left here for the tribulation. Uh, she said, Melissa, not a day goes by that I don't hear in my spirit water, water. These people are going to need water uh, to get more water. She also uh, talked about matches and candles and she said she just felt like the Lord was speaking to her heart that these people in the tribulation are going to be going through the darkest time on earth. and don't let them sit in the dark provide them with matches and candles and uh, she talked about a letter and basically encouraging everybody to share why the rapture took place what happened what not to do like t taking the mark of the beast and I'm sure that many of you have already done this or are in the process of doing this I've done this actually this is this is mine after the church rapture instructions. This is just like, it's really large print as you can see, but it's just two and a half pages uh, of instructions explaining what happened, you know, biblically providing scriptures that explain uh, the rapture was going to take place, uh, explaining that, um, you know, there will be children missing, uh, explaining why the rapture uh, happened, how long the tribulation is going to last, uh, and, and what it's going to look like and really uh, getting into this deception I believe that's going to be promulgated almost immediately after the rapture in order to explain it away and I did a video uh, about that um, and I shared um, an excerpt from uh, Billy Crone's uh, documentary about UFOs and the alien deception to explain away the rapture and if you haven't seen that I encourage you to go watch that and maybe include a portion of that in your letter um, I mean people are going to be looking for answers and they're going to look to whoever has the most logical explanation for what happened and the enemy is on top of it trust me and he's he's going to be um, providing them with an explanation and they uh, they'll be led to take the mark of the beast okay so we, we really need to think about just helping these people who are going to be left here understand what happened uh, they're going to be in shock things are going to start happening very fast you know as soon as the church is removed um, we're the salt of the earth we're the light of the earth as soon as salt is taken out which is a preservative it goes bad whatever the salt is preserving goes rotten okay as soon as this we are taken off the earth this earth is going to start to rot fast and uh, there's not going to be uh, any anybody here who can help them um, you know the everybody that has been sharing these warnings will be gone so the only hope that they'll have is that maybe we left something behind for them some instructions or information uh, Bibles I have several Bibles placed all over my home I handed out these letters to a few of my neighbors who I believe are saved and I'm going to be sending um, a few copies with my sister she's going to be uh, coming down and you know we just we have to really be thinking about what is important to the Lord and we know that uh, the Lord cares about all the people on this earth and and as exciting as it is for us to be going home as exciting as it is for us to you know uh, be you know marrying our groom Jesus um, we need to be remembering that these people are going to be here for a horrific horrific time and if there's anything that the Lord is leading you to do I, I encourage you please please do it and uh, if, there, if you can afford to set some food aside or get some extra water and set it aside um, you know put together a letter explaining things explain you know what the mark of the beast is um, uh, don't take it you know death is better than and starvation is better than taking that mark uh, we know that damnation is guaranteed in Revelation 14. 
uh, for anyone who takes that mark. So I encourage you to, to do that now. And uh, one last thing, I wanted to encourage you to pray for Rhonda Empson. Um, I won't go into the details. They, her family experienced a tragic loss a few days ago, so I'm sure she'll share the details when she's able to do a video again. But um, I'm just asking that you please lift Rhonda and her family up in prayer um, as they are all going through a very, very uh, difficult time right now. Okay, thank you.